Hey people, this is Brick Boys two five one eight. I'm Brick Boy One. I'm Brick Boy Two, aka Chatty Chase. And this is our review of the Lego Star Wars: The Clone Wars Separatist Spider Droid. Limited edition, I might add. And here we go. It comes with Commander Fox. We actually customized him, making his armor red. It comes gray originally, and he comes with two DC seventeen blasters. And I don't know where those are right now. But, uh, they're pretty cool. And one problem was, if you see right here, it's a different color line than the one on the top. I don't know if you can really see that, but what what was the problem with Fox was, his red markings on his helmet were actually painted off. Um, if you look at his fin, it seems kind of off to the side, but... Otherwise, he, it's pretty, he's a pretty good figure. I mean, where do you, where else do you expect to get him besides online, which he's sixty dollars just to buy by himself? And we're gonna move on to the other figures now. It comes with one normal clone, just normal white, um, and his head, which is normal. It comes with another uh, yellow commander battle droid, uh, and he's I'm sorry, another. He comes with only one, and <coughs> he has his yellow armor, nothing special, and I mentioned the straight arm in another one. Um, and it comes with one normal battle droid, also straight armed, and one super battle droid, which is pretty much normal. It has everything you want with it, and it's cool. Now on to the main event. Event, event, event. The problem with the separate spider droid is, it, w it was a pretty fun build, I mean seriously. It was a little bit challenging, not too hard. The, leg, the legs were probably the hardest part. Um, it's actually really flimsy. Like, if you look at this, um, the legs, all they do is flop. You would expect that they would be, like, hard to position. And if you want it full, if you want it out full when it's lying, you, then you need to actually pull the legs out. Now, just so everybody knows, he can't walk. It doesn't walk. Like it's only its legs only move out and in. Like it doesn't do anything else. Continue. Um, it has two posable gun turrets. One on the top and one on the bottom, which moves up and down. The one on the top moves side to side. And it has four posable legs. And up. it also comes with this cool eye. Yeah, red. bubble body and a red eye. So um, yeah, for me, I think it's. I think it's an okay set. I wouldn't call it my favorite. It's limited edition, which makes you think, Oh my god, I gotta have it! Oh my god! But you get it and you're like, Oh, yeah. Um, I would rate this out of ten stars a nine. When I first saw it come out, I'm like, Oh my god, I have to get it. My parents took me to the Lego store, and I didn't have any money. Second time they took me, I forgot my wallet at the house. The third time I finally got it, and I was like, Oh my god, I finally have it. Took it home and it was a really cool build and it's a good set. I give it a uh, six out of ten stars. I think it it looks cool at first, but you get it and it's like, huh. So um, the average going price is thirty dollars. Thirty dollars. Don't forget you also you're also paying for the enhanced limited edition set. I don't know when they're taking it off, but it's a pretty good set. What um most Lego sets are based off. Like, if you're in the hundreds, just minus a zero, and that's can round it up. But if this is $10 more than it should be, but I guess it's okay. A little overpriced, good set. If you're confused about what he's talking about, I have no idea either. We're brothers. We're we'll, going to fight a lot. We'll post it on our channel later. Alright. So, All right. Uh, this is Brick Boy one signing out. This is Brick Boy 2 a.k.a. Chatty Cheese. Check out my channel. Signing out. Hasta la vista, baby.